Hey guys, I'm Jenna, also known as ALA13. Today I'm going to be talking about one of the hardest parts of the miniature to master, the eyes. Human brains are hardwired to recognize faces. Even babies can do this at a very young age. It's that same part of the brain that recognizes faces in inanimate objects that tells us if something is not quite right with the face. We're just hardwired that way. So mistakes on the rest of the model are a little bit more easily forgiven than mistakes on the face. So in order to paint eyes, you're gonna to need to have a certain degree of brush control. What I mean by that is when you put the paintbrush on the model, the paint goes where you want it to. Now, if you don't have that yet, don't worry. You just need to practice some more. You can always come back and do the eyes later. Start by filling the eye indent with black. I often find that sculpted eyes are really tiny, so we can make the eye appear bigger by giving it a thicker outline on the upper and lower lashes. This is what girls are doing when they apply eyeliner. When this is dry, we'll add the whites of the eyes. Now you can use pure white for this, but in reality, no one has truly white eyes unless they're in an eye drop commercial. So I tone mine down a bit by mixing in a little bone color. Add two dots on each side of the eye, the gap between the dots acts as the pupil. Make sure that you leave a little border of black completely outlining each dot. That's it for simple eyes, but if you fancy something a little trickier, we can add color to her iris. Start by blackening the eye as usual and give her some longer lashes. Now I'm gonna paint the entire inside of the eye with my off-white color, leaving a border of black as the outline. The reason I'm doing this instead of adding the dots like before is I need to get a nice round pupil. Paint a black dot in the center when it's dry. Now choose a very bright color and put the dot in the middle of the black circle. Leave a little black outline if you can. Now get your black again and paint a tinier black dot in the top half of this colored circle. And there you have it, a colored iris and eyelash extensions. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like and subscribe.